I came to win, to fight, to conquer, to thrive, I came to win. Hey everyone, I'm Natalie McNeil and you are watching She Takes on the World TV. In today's episode, I'm going to give you seven points to help you beat procrastination and become a productivity queen. Point number one. Ask yourself where you're wasting the most hours and minutes in your day. Now there is a tool that you can use called Rescue Time at rescuetime.com and it'll help you figure out where your time is being wasted so that you can stop doing those things and start being more productive. Two, when do you schedule your day? You shouldn't wake up in the morning and then come up with an action plan for the day. You should always do it the night before so that you wake up in the morning with a clear idea of exactly what you need to be working on. Three, choose your first task in the morning very carefully. I personally like to get done the thing that I really don't want to do first thing so that I can move on with the things that I actually enjoy more for the rest of the day. Four. Force yourself to race against time. Set a time limit for the task that you're doing and then start a timer for it. When that timer is up, you better be done that task. And I find that it is a great way to stay on track and stay focused. It's something that I used when I was writing my book for all the chapters and sections. I usually timed it out and said, okay, Natalie, you've got two hours to get this done. And most of the time, I did in fact get it done when I was watching that clock ticking down. And I didn't let anything else distract me from being focused on that one task that needed to be completed. Next. Rely on a team. Everybody needs a team. It doesn't matter if you're a solo entrepreneur or have a company that already has several employees. Everyone needs to be able to delegate tasks that are wasting their time so that they can be more productive and grow their businesses. Six, prioritize things like family, friends, and exercise so that they never slip by in the course of your day. It's really important that you have that strong support system in place while you're growing a business. And things like your health and exercise are things that you really shouldn't compromise on because if you've got your health, you've got everything that you need. And last, of course, there's an app for that. I use Hootsuite to schedule my social media in batches so that it doesn't take time throughout the day because you know how it is when you get on Twitter, you get on Pinterest, it's easy to spend more time than you anticipated looking through other people's posts. So Hootsuite is great for allowing you to schedule out your social media posts for the day. Another tool I love is Yammer at yammer.com and it really helps your team to stay on top of things by having your own social network specifically for the team that you're working with or the project that you're working on. How do you beat procrastination and stay productive? Leave a comment below and we'll see you in the next episode of She Takes on the World TV. Bye for now. And today I want to talk to you about getting rid of cabin fever, that feeling when you're at home, you're working at home and you just feel trapped, like you need to get out.